This is just beautiful. I, 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 can you imagine having one in your house? All right, guys, 3.04 a.m. Well, I gotta put it on drive before we can go. And this is it, the beginning of our trip. Looking forward. We got my dad here, he's gonna drop us off. Looking all grumpy yeah. at three in the morning. <laughs> Back here we have Lisa. But you can't see. My mom. And that's it, we're uh, on the way to the airport right now to head over to LA. And we're gonna spend two days in LA, do some filming there at Kevin's facility, and then um, head over to China. <laughs> all right, buddy. I love you, man. Take care of the fish, all right? Hi, son. Uh, I promise you're not gonna cry? All right. Love you. So what's the plan now? The flight's oh. leaving in what? Three hours? Six, yeah. All right. No, I'm just gonna have one. What, you gotta go, bro. You got everything? Yeah, you gotta go. <laughs> Thank you. You got the wallet and everything? Yeah. Passport? All right, let's go. All right, guys, so we just arrived in LA and it's beautiful out here. Um, I'm mountains? just amazed that like the whole ride from the airport, you see the mountains over there? It's a little hazy, but they're there. And we don't have that in Florida, so that's a plus. But we just arrived to Stingray Biology. I'm gonna say hi to Kevin, see what he's up to. See, we I think we uh, brought enough. I'm so excited to see this. <laughs> Let us in. Yo! Hey, what's hey. up, man? I thought I was gonna pick you up from the airport. No, 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 I told you yeah. it's gonna take an Uber, man. Oh, okay, cool. Hey, cool. Lisa's here. Hey, Lisa. Hi. Hi. You, can, you can give him a hug, it's okay. Huh? I gotta unload here. Oh, good, man. Oh, okay. How are you? Okay, fine. Good to see you. All right, bro. Yeah. Are you ready? Man, it's been a while since I've seen you. I know, dude. Where, how long ago? I don't know, probably years like two years. We actually met in the jungle in Brazil. How crazy is oh, that? Dude. He was running around like a little, like a little monkey, like a little <laughs> monkey. Can we come in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. Go oh, back. Go back. Go back. What is? Oh my God, bro. First thing. Let's see. No. We got the way. I mean, I I seen a lot of the rays you sent me, but you never sent me one like this. No. no oh. These are these are snow leopards. They're pretty rare. Uh, not much out there right now, so I'm focused on breeding them. Can we get a is this like the rarest one you have? Um, no, it's not the rarest. I have Wait, another one. Where's that one that you said that it's, it's like my big surprise? Like I've never seen one before. It's only one in the world. Oh, well, I'll tell you later. Okay, oh, we gotta get to it. Let's work, let's work into that. Save the best for last. There you right? go. Better than that? Oh yeah, way better oh, than that. Oh god. I feel like a kid right now. So, this is like the first room you walked in. What are these rays? Um, I have a little bit of everything here. This is like, I put all my grow outs in here. Um, there's black diamonds, there's hybrids, there's pearls, you know, all, all different kind of stuff. Most monies. And if you check out the filtration, guys, look, he puts the pumps up high so the rays have plenty of space to swim and not get caught. Oh, surface area. Oh, look at this yeah, guy. And that way the, the food doesn't get sucked up either. That's smart. It's off the ground. You know? See? See, we're going to learn a lot. I right know, jeez. We're going to learn a lot today. This guy's so cool. You gotta learn today. Look at the filtration, it's over the top of the tank. And you got the the filter pad, the, filter pad. the biological filter. Took yep. you a and second. A, oh no, heat, I know. I, I had a long flight, all right? <laughs> yeah, Look, the heater is out of the Wait, tank wait, wait, is this an albino um, diamond? Black diamond? An albino black diamond. Oh I've never seen God, one. Dude. Look okay, at this buddy. thing. Look at the eyes. Zoom yep. in on the eye on it. Hold if on, you can see it. It's like white. The eyeballs are white. It's like crystal. It's pretty cool. It's amazing. I'm sure you have a lot of favorites here. Yeah, yeah. Like these guys up here, these Osmanis. Um, they're pretty cool. Super cool. Guys, when I tell you Kevin is the best, I'm not lying. Like, look at the setup. This is just the beginning. We haven't even gone to the door yet. <sighs> This is insane. Honest though, like you know, when people come into my shop people and then and um and they get they see the big tank and they're like, oh my god, that's the way I feel right now. I think this is just amazing the, the way you set it, up all oh, the filtration. Look at it. Look how beautiful this one is. What is this one, Kevin? That's a hybrid. That's Can a hybrid. you see it? He's, yeah. he's you got a little higher. I, I'm short. There you go. Right there. Oh, yeah, there he is. One of my Whoa. Favorites. 
Oh. I don't know, bro. I might have to take that one from you. They're all so cool, all unique. Right here, right here. Look, look at the front. I'm I got so them. Happy I got to see them. You. Can yeah. you get off them? Look, they're they're stacking up. That's so funny. What do you say? What do you think they're doing? They're playing around or? Um, they're ready to eat. They're probably hungry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we no, can I feed them. I haven't fed them yet. All right, yeah. great. Some albino here. All right, so these are what? These are um, albino. No, no, these are not albinos. What are they? These are pearls, but they're they're look, siblings to look the at albino. This one. Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say they look different. They look like they're they're lighter based. It's a light based pearl. So, so how much is one like this? Like for if we if we want to sell it to one of our fans, what would something like this cost? Okay, babe. Well, th this is a, a different type of albino. There's a red albino and there's a yellow albino. These are the yellow ones, okay. or, or some people call them golden. You see, their eye is more transparent. And has the golden color. These go for you know a few thousand dollars each. They're not cheap. They're beautiful. I mean, that's definitely worth it. And how long would a stingray, a stingray like that live for? Well, if you do years your job and, years and, and years. take care of them, they live a long time. My oldest ray is over 20 years. Wow. So it's definitely worth the, the investment. Oh yes, definitely. They're so cute. That is one of my favorites right here. Oh, it's a marble cool. Matoro. It's always been my favorite. You know, when I first started with Rays, marble Matoros was the affordable one that's yeah. within my range, but it looks beautiful. Marbles is it looks like my first love. It looks different than the ones I import or, or, or come from. Yeah, they're mi yeah, well, mixed. It's a I select, yeah, I selectively breed it for, you know, better color and pattern. What are uh, these? Those are pie. That's the older one. Um, it's so it's cool. Pie is pearl. There's more back here. Okay. Coming. Oh yeah. So, what do you, what do you, why did it happen like that? With just it, a part it's, of their face it's a genetic thing. It's it's like albinos. It's a genetic. Uh, piebald is also a, a recessive gene where they have discoloration, where they have white patches. That's amazing. Yeah. And, and you think that, you know, when they have babies, they might have an albino baby? Or no, they're they're, always going to they'll have white. They'll have more the white patches. I like the white. I think they look cool. I swear, I'm going to like... Holy crap. Look at these things. Look at these tanks. This is another grow-out room, future breeders. This is a, uh, one of my newer setups. They're so active. See, that's why I love when you send look me the them. stingrays. As soon as they arrive, they start eating, they start playing around, they start moving. Yeah. They like look to at this pump tank. each other. And you built all, all your frustration. Yes, I built all the frustration. Every rate, we every serve. corner is every something rate, yeah, that's cooler. True. That's true. What do you think, babe? Beautiful. Can you see? All right. So, what do you what do you think about this? Like, would you imagine if we had this set up? <laughs> would would our lives be a lot I easier? Would never leave. I know. Look how beautiful they are. So, you've been breeding the rays for how long now? I've been doing breeding about what eight, nice nine years, maybe 10 years. Yeah. So but I've been keeping rays for a lot longer than that. So you pretty much know the, everything about them by now. Uh, from experience, yeah. You know, you learn by experience, you know, step by step. You well, know, works they, but yeah, this is, this is the same. Things go bad and you learn from it. I'm, I'm, I'm proud of you, bro. You. I'm proud of you, because <laughs> this is crazy. You really take care of your stuff, bro. I cleaned it because you were coming. No, you know, no, I know you. I know I how you are. make everything look good, you know? No, but I know how you are. You, you, you're you definitely very anal with, with the, yes, your, your, um, your animals, and I'm I anal. see. I'm very anal, yes. <laughs> look at the quality, though. That's just crazy. You think we can get them feeding a little bit? Um, yeah, we'll get to that later. Hello, Watch your step, bro. I meant to say, I meant to say, homie. Wow, this is crazy, guys. To see it in person is a, it's a different perspective. Look at these tanks. So, those are. Whoa. <laughs> these are all your breeders. They're like yeah, bigger than me. And what are these over here? These are grow outs that I'm gonna uh, breed in the future. So these you plan on breeding, not selling? Yes. Really, really cool. Look, there's pups there too. Yeah, there's pups there. Those are a couple of days old. A couple of days? Yeah, you just missed it. If you came two days earlier, we would have caught it. Um, oh, man. Oh, that, that one is so cool. I know. This one. Do you always like want to keep some of them? Do you always have that That's feeling like because it starts out as a hobby? So like almost everything in that first room over there. You want to keep at least sixty percent. I want to keep. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> See, that's I would have the same problem. Like you when I bring that fish, that I, well, with fish. Yeah, you have. But like seeing stingrays like this, like this is amazing. Look at the size of the, bro. 
No, no, hold on, man. Hold on, man. I don't Look think you can this. tell the size if you compare. This is bigger than the one we have at the shop. Yeah. How come you didn't send me that one? <laughs> <laughs> what? It's a female, right? Yeah, it's a female. God, that's just beautiful. Yeah, I want to breed this pattern. That is amazing. That's why I'm keeping those over there. It's, it's one And each of these tanks, you imported them, right? Yes, these fiberglass tanks were imported from overseas. Okay, and how many gallons are they? Uh, they're about 13, 1,400 gallons each. That's perfect. So what do you, like for, for people at home that want to buy a Stingray, what would you suggest for one this size, which is about, what, seven to eight inches, you say, disc? Well, maybe eight, I mean, nine? You can start off, you don't have to go like big tank, you can start off like a 75, 120 gallon tank. So it'll be okay for how long? Um, it'll, it'll, I think it'll do fine in there for at least a year, year and a half, you know, depending on how well you feed it and, and uh, you know, how, how big you want to grow it. You so, know? so you think that the main, uh, um, the main purpose, like on keeping a stingray, what's the number one thing that you got to do to make sure that they're healthy? The water change, water, water change, change, right? Mm -hmm. So that's that's the main thing. Like a lot of times, we have like you guys call us and ask for questions, like, oh, uh, my fish is getting sick. One stingray produces the same amount of waste as what ten fish? Is that what I've seen that yeah, before? Is that real? The, the, they produce a lot more waste than normal fish, and the way their waste comes out, it's not like solid pieces, like how like cichlids and whatever. Right. It, it comes out like all slimy and, and nasty kind of. So it pollutes the water. So they, they do produce a lot more waste compared to another type of fish that same size. So like he was showing me a little bit earlier, the water is draining on that side all day long. Can you see it like the green drain all the way down there? To the right? Yep. And it's coming out of there. How many gallons of water do you say you got changing every day? In this system, I change about a thousand gallons. This is one whole system. Okay, so a thousand gallons a day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work to make sure that they have this quality and you know become this beautiful. Yeah, that's why people don't understand like the, the work that it takes. You know, every You're giving day. away all my secrets. I man. know. Come on. That's, 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 oh. There's so much oh, more to see. Boy. I'm just I'm just like I don't know what to say. Well, stop talking.